Hello, my name is Sandy Renteria and today I'm going to do a tutorial on what are the steps that you need to do whenever you buy your Platinum Poster program. And the first thing that you will do, you will go um, download all the files and they will be zip files so you'll have to unzip those. And one of the files that you're first going to unzip that is important is going to be your Platinum Facebook My Groups tool. Once you unzip that, you're going to open it up and you are going to hit run up here on the left top. And once that runs, what you're going to have to do is you're going to put in your Facebook email address, your Facebook password, and then it's going to ask you for where you want these files, the groups to be saved in. And today I'm just going to use December 2013 groups um, and I'll t explain a little bit more about what my purpose is today. So anyway, um, once that runs, it um, it actually pulls up all your your Facebook and all your groups and then it is going to upload them into a um, notepad let me scoot this over it's a, a notepad and it's going to just list all your groups and um, this is all fine but you don't really know what groups they are some of them indicate you know by the um, ending what their group name is but so what I did I went ahead and did a alt a for cop or highlight them all and then I did a um, right click copy and then I actually copied those over into a word document and I'll show you what I did um, let me pull this over and stretch it out a little bit um, oops, let me go back to my Word document. There we go. And um, then I just copied them into my Word document. And one of the first things that I did once I copied them into my Word document, I hit sort. And I sorted them so that they'll be in chronological order and alphabetical as, let me see if I can scroll them down. You can see down toward the bottom where they're, if it's going to let me where they become alphabetical and the reason I do that is because now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back into my Facebook group and I am going to open up every Facebook group that I have and the reason I'm doing that individually is a couple of purposes one is because I want to make sure that the group that I have listed will allow you to post in it and if it does, I go ahead and, as you can tell right here, I highlight it that the group allows you to go ahead and post in that group, so it's a good group. Um, if it doesn't allow you to post in there, I go ahead and delete it, um, just because I don't want it to be saved in my groups. Because whenever I do my posting through post a Platinum Poster, I don't want it to come into a glitch. So. Um, like I said, this is the first thing that you're going to need to do, and I know it's going to be time consuming, but I promise you the end, re end result is going to be awesome. So, um, like I said, I'm just going in through, I've only done probably half of my groups. I'm in, oh, I think, over 400 groups. So, um, I go ahead and click on that group. Um, it's going to open up, and as you can tell up here at the top, well, first of all, this group, as as it has a little bit of caption, you can't see it over here, but it tells you a little bit about the group, and it tells you whether, you know, no spammers or no links or whatever. This one is fine. It allows you to post, and as you can tell, you can post right here. So I would go up here to the browser bar. I would see their name, which is marketing, this last part, after the forward slash, um, after the groups it says marketing masterminds and so I'd go back over here to my um, Word document and I'd scroll down to my the name of it which is um, marketing masterminds and it's right here and I would go ahead and highlight that and I would highlight it in yellow so that I know that that group is a good group to post in other than that like I said it's very time consuming but this is the first step that you're going to need to take in order to make 
platinum poster work at its best. So anyway, I hope this helped. Um, oh, and after you do this, then you're you can go ahead and you know highlight all these in your Word document um, and copy them back over to your notepad here and just replace this because then you know that those are all good um, groups and then you can divide them into groups of I would say no more than 200 in a group because otherwise um, you might get put in Facebook gel if you post more than 200 groups a day. So anyway, I hope this helped. Um, if you got value out of it, please go ahead and share. Um, if you have other questions, please, you know, feel free to, you know, send me a message. I'd be more than happy to help. Other than that, you guys go out and have a great day. And remember, always love what you do. Thanks. Bye.